Hey everyone, I'm going to film this full game of Cthune vs Yogg and opening with Cthune is a big no. I'll keep that one, but I need, I just don't need Cthune in the, in the, in the, yeah that was dumb. Oh come on Cthune! <laughs> I love the new map though, though, there's an old god in each thing, so you've got the eyes there. Needs to get, needs to get him buffed at least. This is not a good draw. This one is not a good draw. And oh, that's where the well normally is. Oh, wow. My keep is a good draw, though. Well, I suppose it is, and it isn't at the same time. I could just swipe. I'm not too sure my keep really does for him when he can just become the 4 3. Well, he's been the face that I have to trade, but if I'm honest, I think, yeah. I think it's a bit better, unless he's got a removal spell, which he might have. So he doesn't care, it's like, the, the deck itself just doesn't amazingly care. I'm just kidding. Oh, what was I thinking of, what was I thinking of casting? Um, I probably will definitely try Cthulhu in every class. To make videos for all of them. Swipe. I mean, I really wanted to play there, the six cast guy, but I just think it's just. I need to kill, you need to kill this thing. Like, no other. He's such a broken card. You just need to kill him. That's my favourite bit of this arena, it's just the eyes and then the tentacles coming out. It's fucking hilarious. He stopped me playing my Cthune cards, anyway. He stopped me playing my Cthune stuff. It's not the end of the world though, it's fine. I'm gonna have to play the yeah, I don't, well, saying that I can't, I can, I can remove Thorazan, but it's like... I'm giving one more turn by doing this, but then I am buffing the Cthune to 13. End of the day, it's the point of my deck, so... In this game, at least we've actually got him. Flame is a really nice card. 
he just got far too much value off that Borazan. But, kind of much about it, I mean... The problem is, Cthulhu's going to be on, I mean, if I play, it's going to be 15. It's not enough. It isn't enough, because he just polymorphs it, or freezes it, and it's just... Well, I've used both swipes as well, mate. Oh my god, I left that boys out on the field too long. I mean, don't get me wrong. Thirteen damage across the board then is pretty back in the deck afterwards. I mean, it'd be interesting if he polymorphs it. If he polymorphs it, then I don't know actually. I don't actually know what happens. Oh, please don't say you can just kill me, because I'd be so upset if you just kill me now. Oh, <laughs> the god showdown! <laughs> I got ancestral spirit. Oh my god. Don't you dare cast Polymorph on me. <laughs> <laughs> no. No! <laughs> and he gets, oh, it's got Ancestral Spirit on it. Oh, hell no. Cast Ancestral Spirit on itself, so it just comes back. Oh my god, that makes me the s person in the world right now. I just don't know what to say about that. I drop a Cthulhu, I have a plan with Cthulhu, and then I was like, Go on, Sestral Spirit, it's fine, mind control. And it was never gonna mind control. Uh, only one minion each board, so it was never gonna mind control. But hey, that is the fun of Yogs are on, and I do probably need to make my own one. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. This is uh, gonna be the. Uh, I don't know what I was going to say then, but thank you for watching. This has been really good fun. I love Cthulhu, and the deck's amazing. I um, think that deck is just insane, the one that Dan's got, but it's just so him. The card is using. It doesn't care. It just doesn't care. Um, so I'll see you guys soon.